Yes, we did hit 100 today. Yes, I'm forecasting another seven on the way. No, this is not a repeat of previous hot years. 19 days so far in 2024 at or above 100. Compare that to last year. To date, 52 days of triple digits on our way to the second highest total of 80. Let's go back to 2011, shall we? To date, 59 days of triple digits on our way to that record of 90 total. Do you feel a little bit better? Maybe a little bit cooler? I'm trying to help at least. It will be dangerous heat, but it will not be unprecedented. We're not going to set any records along the way. Outside right now, it's still 90. A little bit of cloud cover keeping temperatures up a tad. It still feels like 98 degrees. Heat advisories are in place for Milan County through at least tomorrow evening. I have a hunch, though. The Austin area I-35 points east will probably be added to heat advisories. The combination of heat plus humidity may make it feel like as hot as about 108, 109 in the Austin area tomorrow with another high temperature of 100 degrees. Here's how we get there. And if you're heading to school tomorrow, it's the first day of school for Round Rock ISD. 79 degrees out the door. Afternoon high 100. It is going to be a hot and steamy, but also dry day. There's a front drape to our north and east. It's not heading in. It is not going to bring us rain. In fact, if we want rain, sea breeze showers are about the only chance and they'll probably land to our south and east. Why? Well, right now we've got this big dome of high pressure that is over us, keeping us hot. And what's going to happen through the next several days is that high pressure dome is going to meander across the Lone Star State, perhaps strengthen just to our west and then build back in. As that building back in comes in and it gets closer and closer and stronger and stronger in the Austin area, that's going to send our temperatures to as high as 104 by next week. Meantime, we do have Ernesto, a brand new tropical storm. It's likely to head to near Puerto Rico by later in the day and on into the next couple of days before turning to the north. Bermuda could be dealing with a hurricane later on into the late weekend, the weekend. For us, it's just hot and dry with more triple digits. Hang in there and stay cool.